happening right now. Metro is holding a closed door emergency board meeting today. I'm Erica Gonzalez. Thank you for joining us. The meeting comes after a scathing report from the Safety Commission found over unqualified train operators. News Force Amy Cho joins us live outside Metro headquarters. Amy, we know that it's a rare um, moment to see Metro's board calling an emergency meeting like this one. So what do we know about what is being discussed behind those closed doors? Hi, Erica. Well, we know the Metro Safety Commission says some people driving Metro trains are unqualified and have not finished the required safety training. Now, this comes after a number of concerning incidents recently involving Metro train operators. Last July, the Safety Commission says a train operator did not know Franconia Springfield was the end of the blue line. Then in November, a train operator worked 30 days in a row and blew past track workers at an excessive speed. And then in December, a train operator, quote, didn't know where where they were in the system and ran a red signal. Now, as far as the lack of training for employees, the Safety Commission says Metro leadership told managers to, quote, make no trains available for training and stopped giving new operators time behind the wheel with an instructor. Now, according to the Safety Commission, the operator who ran a red signal had only practiced for nine minutes out of the required eight hours, and the operator who recently overran a station had never driven a train on mainline during training. Now, the Safety Commission also says Metro promised last April to make a number of safety fixes, such as increasing the amount of training for operators. But according to the commission's report, Metro has already fallen behind on that plan and missed the first deadline. Now, Metro did announce on Friday they will be giving extra practice on a simulator to 64 operators who just recently finished their training classes. Now, this emergency board meeting has been closed session, so unfortunately, we have not been allowed in. One of the board members does tell me they plan to hold a press conference on this matter tomorrow. Erica?